What does half-life mean? This is Ben. Hello. Ben suffers from a blood coagulation disorder known as haemophilia. <laughs> In spite of this, he leads a normal, active life. Ben works and likes to go to the gym. To protect him from hemorrhages, Ben receives so-called prophylactic treatment. This means that Ben has to be given regular infusions, about every two days, to protect him from bleeding. With these infusions, his body receives a certain protein, the so-called coagulation factor, which he cannot produce himself. An important term associated with the function of the coagulation factor is the half-life. The half-life is the time which the body needs to use up half of the initial coagulation factor. With every half-life time which passes, the quantity of coagulation factor in his body reduces by half. For example, let us assume that Ben's coagulation medication has a half-life of 12 hours. He is given an infusion at 8 a.m. on Monday morning. The half-life of 12 hours means that 12 hours later, at 8 p.m. in the evening, there is only one half of the quantity of coagulation factor in his body. A further 12 hours later, at 8 a.m. on Tuesday, his body only contains half of the quantity which was present at 8 p.m. Monday evening, mm. a quarter of the original quantity. It is very important that Ben's body always has an adequate quantity of coagulation factor available. Often, it does not make sense to have an injection shortly before going to sleep, because in this case, the highest level of protection is at a time when you are not active. It is important to know that the coagulation factor reduces at the same rate, regardless of activity. There are a large number of coagulation medications which all have different half-lives. Everyone also has their own half-life time. Because of this, the coagulation factors are used up by the body at different rates. Together with your medical care team, you can decide which days and times are best for your infusions, depending on your activities. Please also consult your medical care team if you have hemorrhages, even though you are complying with your prophylaxis.